Hello everyone and welcome back to the Common Sense Crypto Channel. As with you always, this is Rich doing another video today on XDC. So I hope you're all having a wonderful day today wherever you are in this great, great world. We're going to talk about XDC and I don't know about you, but I am very excited right now. This cryptocurrency is finally starting to move upward and i think we're going to continue upward from here you know back when we were all the way down here i kept saying stack this cryptocurrency stop overlooking this cryptocurrency look at the potential behind this cryptocurrency all throughout last year i kept saying look at all this growth with no price movement finally we're starting to see the value in xdc XDC Network, fasten your seatbelts. This isn't a bullish prediction. It's just world trade knocking on Zinfin's door. Blockchain is about global commerce. It would be a mistake not to invest in one of the few regulated networks dedicated to it. You know, I said it before. There is no alternative to XDC. You know, anybody who's holding XRP or XLM needs to be holding this cryptocurrency as well. Because this is also a major money mover of the future. XDC Network top gainer in July of 2023 ahead of XRP and XLM. And it's starting to move on its own. It's moving away from XRP and XLM. They're still going sideways while XDC is continuing upward. And look at that ecosystem. You know, I remember telling you you know this is a major announcement around this like Travala and I said Impel look at this major announcement around that but I told you even back then it takes time for this to grow out and now we're starting to see everything come together perfectly exploring Zinfin official and an overview of its enterprise applications now this is coming from House of Chimera and this is why I always said XDC is very, very well-rounded. It's probably one of the most well-rounded cryptocurrencies out there today. Enterprise Solutions, the XDC Network offers a robust platform for developing a variety of scalable, secure, and swift blockchain-based enterprise solutions. We are still early. Enterprise hasn't even got here yet. And wait until Enterprise starts coming on board this network. ISO 222 Capability. XDC Network seamlessly integrates with ISO 222, enabling secure, scalable, and efficient global financial messaging. Now you're starting to see the importance of ISO. If XDC wasn't compatible with ISO, it would not be used inside of digital trade. Digital Asset Composer. The network offers a tool that enables creation of digital assets without the need for coding, including smart contracts and DeFi protocols. No coding. It's so easy to use. And when something's easy, people will use it. Compliance and Custodial Solutions, XDC Network provides compliance solution for blockchain applications and custodial solutions for digital assets, mitigating trading risk and ensuring transparent transactions. And that's going to be very important as all money starts to move digitally. Cross-chain interoperability. The XDC Network hosts multiple bridges for cross-chain interoperability, working with other EVM-compatible blockchains. And you know what else? We're starting to see a lot of projects move away from Ethereum. Some are going over there to Hedera. Some are going to come to XDC. Asset tokenization. This is the big one for me. Real-world assets can be transformed into digital assets via smart contracts, offering access to capital markets and creating a borderless exchange. Once your crypto is tied in with tokenization, that is game changing. That's going to be the next big thing in crypto. And I think XDC is going to grab a large portion of tokenization in the future. And that's going to really start to amp up after September. Now take a listen to this because this is also very big. 
Hello everyone, I'm Bruno San Martin, CMO of Prime Numbers, and in this video, I will do a monthly update about everything that we've done in the last month. So at the beginning of July, we went to Ethereum Barcelona. It's one of the biggest events in Europe, and since XDC was the main sponsor, we represented them. And thanks to this event, we could share our ecosystem with hundreds of attendees. We also made some improvements in Primeport, as you guys know, the first decentralized NFT marketplace on the XDC network, and we updated the profile system. From now, on, from now on, everything is working perfect. We will just do some little updates. Finally, the lending and borrowing platform, uh, Prime Numbers Finance, will be available very, very soon. So XDC users will be able to lend and borrow their tokens. And this is very important because it's going to increase the total value lock on the network, and it's also going to increase the value of XDC, and that's also going to benefit us. Um, by the end of the month, Arturo Cantera visited Paris. He went to the Ethereum Community Conference, and we made great connections there that are going to help us. Lending and borrowing your XDC. That is an absolute game changer. And I said early on, when this was first talked about, I said, that's going to add value to XDC. And sure enough, he just explained the same exact thing right there. And, you know, once you could lend and borrow against your crypto, that's game changing. That leads to passive income in the future. I know what I hold. It's so early in this space, so I just keep buying. Once XDC gets to Ethereum's market cap, it will base on tech alone. We will be good forever. And you see right here, XDC's price with Ethereum's market cap would be $16.05. That is huge. And that's why I keep telling you, even at $0.07, cents, keep buying this cryptocurrency because I still think we're headed upward from here. And at some point, we're going to see a major blast off. Continuing our journey down memory lane, take a look at more significant milestones from the XDC network story. Remember back in 2022, and we were talking about announcements like this, the XDC network became the first blockchain selected as a member of the trade finance distribution initiative a consortium of trade originators credit issuers and institutional funders as of today it remains the only blockchain member then this happened in 2022 as well impel launches on the xdc network and brings iso 222 financial messaging compliance and the interface for the r3 core to bridge to the xdc network both of which significantly benefit enterprise use cases. And that took time to build out. Now here we are, May 2023. XDC Network significantly expands into Japan via the SBI Group subsidiary, SBI VC Trade. This development also integrates the entire XDC ecosystem and its efficiency, transparency, and reduced cost to the Japanese market, a critical hub for international trade. SBI is bridging with or partnering with XDC around trade. SBI is connecting with Ripple and partnering with Ripple for cross-border payments for the banking sector. That's how you know each one of these cryptocurrencies are going to be utilized for their own use case. You know, everybody always said, well, XDC versus XRP or XDC versus XLM. These cryptocurrencies were never competing with each other. And thanks to SBI, we actually see exactly how it's going to work inside the new financial system. Each cryptocurrency doing their own part. Japan's banking giant SBI VC Trade offers staking interest from 4% to 8% with industry trade finance coin XDC by Zinfin, the trade finance group. SBI Group owns about 14 banks. They see the potential in XDC. And you know, this brings XRP and XDC even closer together in the future. You're going to be able to see how they will interact at some point because i think everything is going to be connected one way or another infocom media development authority singapore has integrated the xdc network 
This integration provides another blockchain-enabled platform that will enable government bodies and businesses to digitize cross-border trade. Like I said, there's only one XDC, and all the growth is starting to happen now. So you see countries talking about this cryptocurrency. That's when you really need to pay attention, because it's absolutely game-changing. Globian's exchange platform makes it easy to buy and sell cryptocurrencies, trade, wager, or hold fiat currency in the form of Globian's exclusive stablecoin, peg to fiat currency at one to one ratio. Globian's is another major project on XDC. And I'm going to do a separate video talking about that in the near future. Don't make the mistake I did with XDC. Bought in December, sold my bag in February, and stacked XLM and XRP instead of stacking all three. You know, everybody keeps saying, sell your XDC and put it into XRP. It's going to be the first mover. You should never do that. Continue to hold the cryptocurrencies that you hold right now and diversify. Start buying a little bit of all three of these cryptos. Don't sell one to buy another. People do that all the time inside of crypto. And guess what? They end up losing money in the end. I feel like XDC is my dark horse. No one talks about it. I keep stacking it. And I know one day it will take off and surprise me. People will be buying it when it's more, way more expensive. That was in June of this year when this tweet went out. And you know, back in June, I kept saying, it, these prices are not going to hold. And you know, people in the comments section said, well, it just went down again. Well, when it goes down, you want to keep buying again. Because then what happens next is what we're witnessing right now. And this is just the beginning. 2024 will be our last chance to get millionaire in crypto before the world economic crash starting in 2025. A lot of people keep saying we're going to cash out right before the crash. You're not going to be cashing out in U.S. dollars because by the time you're ready to cash out in crypto, the U.S. dollar is going to be so far down in value. That's why I said you got to find something else to cash out into whether it be gold, silver, something else, or maybe just continue holding on to your crypto. We're starting to see how you can borrow and lend out your crypto, live off the passive income from it. That's how you get generational wealth. And you know, everybody's so quick to sell. When you're working, when you're holding a cryptocurrency like XDC, you should never want to sell too soon. There's Cryptocurrency has so much potential in it. It's going to be a high-valued stablecoin in the future, backed by real-world assets. And you, tokenization hasn't even really got off the ground yet. Wait until that really, really starts to amp up. Who knows where these cryptocurrencies are going in the future? I'm still thinking utilities really going to kick in at some point. But until then, we stay patient, stay positive, watch everything build out, and watch our precious XDC continue upward. With that said, I'm going to wrap up this video. I want to thank you all for watching. I appreciate all of you. I'll see you in the next one. Have a great night.